Calvin Ridley's transition to the Tennessee Titans has been anything but smooth, and frustrations seem to have reached a breaking point. Following a discouraging 20-17 loss to the Indianapolis Colts, Ridley opened up about his limited involvement in the Titans' passing game, which has fallen far below what many expected when he joined the team on a four-year, $92 million contract this offseason. Ridley, who went without a single catch on eight targets against the Colts, didn't hold back in voicing his frustration. After the game, he candidly expressed to reporters that the timing of his touches is impacting his ability to find a rhythm on the field. I need some targets in the beginning of the expletive game, too, Ridley said. Expletive is getting crazy for me. The star wide receiver admitted that his performance needs improvement but argued that early game involvement could have helped him be more effective. It is what it is, he said. I sucked today. I gotta be better. But I gotta get the ball a little earlier in the game so I can be in the game and here with the team so I can play well also. The Titans had high expectations for Ridley, especially as quarterback Will Levi's go-to target in head coach Brian Callahan's offensive system. Yet, the reality has fallen short. Through five games, Ridley has accumulated just nine receptions for 141 yards and one touchdown. His stats paint a picture of a receiver struggling to find his place in the offense, and his comments reflect a growing frustration with his lack of impact on the field. Sunday's game against the Colts marked a low point. Ridley's sole contribution came on a nine-yard carry, further fueling his discontent as he had been hoping to be more of an active participant in the passing game. The Titans' offense as a whole has been in flux under Callahan, who, last week, took accountability for Ridley's struggles by acknowledging that he needed to do a better job of getting the ball to his playmaker. Following the loss to the Colts, Callahan reiterated his commitment to finding ways to make Ridley more integral to the team's offensive plans. We can't win like that, he said. He'll be one of the first ones to tell you that's disappointing. He's one of our best players, and we look to him to try to make a play or two, and we didn't get it done at the end of the game. While Callahan is clearly aware of the challenges in integrating Ridley effectively, the source of the issue remains unclear. Despite the Titans' ongoing struggles and Levi's leading the league in interceptions with seven on the season, Callahan continued to stand by his young quarterback, underscoring his belief in Levi's potential as a leader for the team. With the Titans now at a disappointing 1-4, finding a way to unlock Ridley's potential could be key to turning their season around. The receiver's frustration, however, highlights a larger problem within Tennessee's offense, where a star player is struggling to make an impact and find his place. As Callahan and Levi's work to develop chemistry with Ridley, the pressure is mounting to address the disconnect before the season slips further out of reach.